In the labyrinthine world of finance, where risk and reward dance a perpetual tango, one figure emerged not just as a player, but as a maestro orchestrating the very fabric of trading itself. Jim Simons, a mathematician of extraordinary acumen, not only became the greatest trader of all time, but reshaped the landscape of finance. This video delves deeper into the various facets of Simon's journey, from his mathematical roots to the intricacies of Renaissance technologies, the enigmatic medallion fund, personal tragedies, and the legacy that extends beyond the realm of financial markets. The formative years of a mathematical mind. Jim Simon's journey commenced in Brooklyn, Massachusetts, where a family doctor's advice to pursue medicine collided with his innate passion for mathematics. Despite societal expectations, Simons chose the unconventional path, and his mathematical brilliance would eventually lead him to MIT, Harvard, and a groundbreaking career as a codebreaker during the Cold War. Renaissance Technologies, a mathematical revolution. In 1978, Simons founded Renaissance Technologies, initially named Monometrics, with a vision to decode hidden market patterns. What set the Renaissance apart was not just its mathematical approach, but Simons's conviction that markets moved logically. The firm's early days were marked by trading currencies, commodities, and bonds, but the complexity of stocks led Simons to envision a fully algorithmic trading system. The birth and evolution of Medallion. Medallion, Renaissance's flagship hedge fund, emerged as the epitome of Simons' vision. Initially facing challenges with a mix of mathematical models and human intuition, the fund truly took off when Simons enlisted the help of mathematician James Axe. The fusion of historical data, advanced algorithms, and a relentless pursuit of patterns laid the foundation for Medallion's unparalleled success. Adapting to tragedy and mastering stocks, Simons' life was marked by personal tragedy, including the loss of his son Paul. However, Grief fueled his dedication to work, leading to the recruitment of Robert Mercer and Peter Brown. Their expertise in transcribing speech into text transformed the Renaissance's capabilities, particularly in stock trading. The introduction of a highly sophisticated automated stock trading system in 1995 propelled Medallion to staggering returns. The Renaissance Enigma The success of the Renaissance and Medallion is shrouded in mystery. Employees, bound by non-disclosure agreements, safeguard the firm's coding and algorithms. Efforts by competitors to unravel the Renaissance code remain fruitless, highlighting the firm's mastery of quantitative finance and data analysis. Philanthropy and Legacy As Simons achieved unparalleled success in the financial world, his attention turned towards philanthropy. The Simons Foundation, with a focus on autism research and unraveling the origins of the universe, stands as a testament to his commitment to making a lasting impact beyond trading. Simons's legacy extends beyond financial markets, solidifying his position not just as a trader, but as a mastermind of science and humanitarian pursuits. Jim Simons is a legendary figure in the world of finance, renowned for his exceptional mathematical prowess and his transformation of Renaissance technologies into one of the most successful hedge funds in history. Born on April 25, 1938, in Newton, Massachusetts, Simon's life has been marked by academic brilliance, pioneering contributions to mathematics, and groundbreaking success in quantitative finance. Academic Background Jim Simons' journey into the world of mathematics began at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, where he earned his bachelor's degree in mathematics in 1958. He continued his studies at the University of California, Berkeley, completing his Ph.D. in mathematics by 1961. Simons's early work focused on geometry and topology, and he made significant contributions to the field, earning him a position as a faculty member at MIT and later at Harvard University. Codebreaking and Cold War Service During the Cold War, Simons applied his mathematical acumen in service to the United States. He joined the Institute for Defense Analyses, IDA, a research organization that aided the National Security Agency, NSA, in deciphering Soviet codes. Simons played a crucial role in code-breaking efforts during this period, founding Renaissance Technologies. In 1978, 
Jim Simons shifted his focus from academia to finance and founded Renaissance Technologies, initially named Monometrics. His vision was to apply mathematical and scientific principles to the world of trading, a strategy that was unconventional at the time. Renaissance began by trading currencies, commodities, and bonds. But Simon soon recognized the potential for even greater success in the stock market. Jim Simons' life story is not merely a tale of financial triumph. It's an odyssey of a brilliant mind navigating through the complexities of mathematics, tragedy, and innovation. His legacy, woven with threads of algorithmic mastery and philanthropic endeavors, casts a long shadow over the financial world. Simon's journey serves as an inspiration for those who dare to challenge the status quo, proving that success, when guided by intellect and innovation, can transcend traditional boundaries and redefine the very nature of achievement. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating journey into the life of Jim Simons, the mathematical genius who revolutionized trading. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more insightful content. Share your thoughts in the comments below and stay tuned for our next exploration into the world of finance, innovation, and remarkable individuals. Until then, keep learning and stay curious.